Hey guys, so I just wanted to like make another video on the review of, well, just reviewing the Simpsons episode where it involves Homer and his relationship with his mom, Mona Simpson. So I'm like, for that emotional series of episodes where Homer is like trying to accept the fact that his mom, Mona Simpson, is like was busy trying to prevent global warming and, you know, basically just trying to make sure, you know, you know, basically being an eco-friendly person as, like, or as they would say, eco-friendly terrorist. And he's like, Mom, why you wasn't around? And then she's trying to tell him, like, Son, I was busy doing this, though. I can't, much as I would love to be involved in your life, it's... I'm kind of sort of busy with this, you know, so she tried her best to be involved in his life, you know, and what had me crying, I'm pretty sure this had everybody else who lost their mom crying, is that Homer, the minute that he was about to, like, forgive her and, you know, accept her, it was too late, and she was already among, among the deceased, and, and I'm like... Damn, that shit hurts, man, because cause we all, like, again, those of us that lost our moms, we know that feeling all too well, because that, that type of pain doesn't go away, man, and seeing Homer experience our type of pain, it's like, we just want to give him a Care Bear hug, and it's like, dude, we all felt that type of pain, it hurts like a motherfucker, man, just, let's just hug it out, man, so... After that ep said episode, then there's a couple more episodes where she, like, in the dream sequence, she's, like, always there for Homer. And it's, like, Homer is, like, oh, deaf, you saved me. And then she's, like, I'm not deaf. I'm your mom's dude. It's me. And everybody's happy to see her. And then she's, like, telling Homer in this dream sequence episode, it's, like, She's, like, saying, like, dude, like, I'm always going to be here for you, man. Like, and she's going down memory lane and whatnot. And because this was that episode where Homer was trying to figure out why he always constantly wet the bed a lot. And then once he got down to the root source of it, it was mostly came back full circle of him not having his relationship with his mom. So it was just that. And it's, like, and if... if it's like, it's one of those like emotional episodes where you just like, kind of feel bad for Homer, but at the same time you kind of glad that he has some closure. So it's, yeah, it's, it's just kind of sad watching these fictional characters, like lose their mom and like, they go through the same pain we go through, and it's hard to watch seeing them cry because then. We end up crying because it's like, dude, you're experiencing my pain. Of course I'm going to cry because it's like, that shit doesn't go away, man. Because then every time when it hits Mother's Day, we look around and we don't see our mom around. So. <sighs> ah. Yeah, it's... It's a good episode, it's just, all I can say is, if you're going to watch those episodes, when you when you get to that, um, when when that episode starts to appear, I could, all I can say is, those that have their mom around, just, just make sure you give your mom a lot of fucks after seeing all those episodes, man, because that will make you cry, because if anything, would these cartoons, whenever a fictional character loses their mom, that's going to make you, do make whoever has their mom around value their mom more than they already do. Because, yeah. And any mom that loses their son, it the pain is still the same either way. No matter how, which way, however it goes, it's still the same. It's, yeah, it's just, wow. But yeah, that's my review. Um, 
I don't really have the script there because I'm not one of those YouTubers. Again, not I don't really have stuff scripted. I just like, you know, talk to y'all guys like I would normally talk to y'all guys in person. So, yeah. Anyway, see y'all later.